We're here at the link for this NFC matchup between the Packers and the Eagles. Phil, in this game, two of the best quarterbacks in the game. Aaron Rodgers and Michael Vick about to meet. Well, we talk about uh, Aaron Rodgers and Michael Vick. Aaron Rodgers is, no matter how his game, the game is going or how the previous week went, really never satisfied, Jim, when you talk to him. He just wants to continue to get better. And with Michael Vick, we all know about the tremendous arm. He moves around. But what we got to see is just more consistent play during the game that can lead him to victories and get him in position to get a chance to go to the playoffs and, and do what everybody wants to do, win the Super Bowl. Defense comes out of the nickel. First and ten. LaShawn McCoy takes the handoff. Going to be a tackle for a loss. So many things you can do on first down, and what do you come up? You come up with that play. That was just a bad play call. LaShawn McCoy is in the backfield. Second and 11. Long ball to Deshaun Jackson, but it's incomplete. This defense is ready to pounce here early in this game as a third and long play is coming up. They sure are. There's no doubt about that. They got themselves in a good situation here. If I'm the quarterback now, third long, I would be very cautious and conservative. The Eagles all bunched up here as they get set at the line. Michael Vick will take it from the gun. Makes the grab, man. He's going to be tackled, and that's going to bring us to fourth down. Jim, when you get in these situations, there's not much you can do. Third and long, not easy to pick up first downs in these type of situations. The Packers lined up in the nickel. They're running the option. Here's the pitch. Tackle down at the 46-yard line. Well, I like the decision that time to go for it on fourth and short. You, know, you got some big old hogs up front. They're pretty strong, so it's fourth down. Go for it, and you pick it up. They're able to move the chains after that last run. Right back to them one more time. Middle linebacker. That means stay in the middle and make it happen. That time, he takes on the block, gets off of it, makes the hit for no gain. Wide receivers are bunched up. Vick in shotgun formation. He'll fire it out to the left. That's an interception. Get that weak ass shit and out of here. here he goes. That was a terrible yeah, throw by the quarterback. When you're off target like that, you deserve to throw an interception. Lines up here. No margin for error from just outside the goal line. Makes Easy. the grab. Too Touchdown. Easy with Roger. If you go to an NFL practice, they spend about 40% of their time practicing plays going in to score. That's why they made it look so easy here. Nice throw by the quarterback on first and goal. The Eagles are prepared to return the kickoff. Just past the 20, we'll mark it at the 22-yard line. Hey. 
They come to the line, and it's first down. And throws it incomplete. This drives coaches crazy. They get a wide receiver open down the field on a post route, and what happens? The quarterback just overthrows it. The Packers defense now is going to go nickel. Challenging the defenders to the right side, right on the money. That time the pass is completed into double coverage, Jim, but the quarterback made a bad read. But these receivers, they are so good nowadays. That time in double coverage, he went up and made the catch. It's like Bill Parcell said to me once about Mark Navarro, a very talented receiver. He goes, remember, Sims, when he's covered, he's open. What a good job by the defensive player there, just flushing the running back and driving him into the ground. Michael Vick will be under center. Second and seven. Very nearly intercepted. And that was a battle for the football, Phil. That time, the defense won out incomplete. Yeah, nice job, Jim. That time by the defensive back just being aggressive and, get, and making sure the receiver could not make the catch. LaShawn McCoy is in the backfield. Pass is picked off by Tremont Williams. That brings the play to an end. I, know, I have to say that's just a terrible decision by the quarterback there. He's got to know when you're in a situation like this, you just cannot make that type of pass. Lines up here. First and ten. Going off tackle here. They run right. It's away from the there stack. <laughs> that one for 46 yards. Well, the defensive coach is going to be upset after this play. After that long run, terrible angles, and really just a lack of hustle by the defense gives up the long run. down following the long play first and ten looks to his left Nelson's got it on a pass that had some heat nice job by the quarterback finding the open guy short they get the completion they still do not get the first down though Offense lines up here. Out of the eye. The give to the tailback. There's the tackle, but still, it's enough for the first down. Good job that time by the offense. They pick up a first down inside the 20-yard line. Now we'll see if they can punch it in and get seven points. Rodgers will be under center. First and ten. Screen play is on. Well, Jim, I can't say that's great defense. That's just a poor throw and a poor route run by the wide receiver. Back off the line, shotgun formation. Second down to 10. 
He's looking to the right here on this throw. At it for a moment, but the ball is knocked out incomplete. Good anticipation that time by the defender. He gets to the receiver just as the football is arriving, and he makes a beautiful hit to knock the football loose. The Packers are at the line of scrimmage with a spread formation. Third and ten. Eyeing that left side. Gets a hand on that one to knock it away. He's such a smart linebacker. That's one of the reasons why he was able to knock that pass down that time. He diagnosed the play. He saw what it was going to be. Got himself in position, and he made it happen. Good for three. When offense drives the ball, they always want to get something out of it, get some points. This time, the field goal kicker gets it done. He gives them three. The Eagles are prepared to return the kickoff. That return ends rather quietly, short of the 20. Let's mark him at the 16. The Packers come out in the nickel. First and 10. Looking for an open receiver on the right. A tackle behind the line. Good job by the defense. They stopped the first down play that time by the offense, and now they have a good situation. McCoy is a running back, but he's in the slot for this play. And he's going to pitch it here. Muscles through the defender. That hit by B.J. Raji. In this defense, they are tough. When you run that football, they got some men up front, and that time they stopped that run just for a short game. The defense comes out in the nickel. Third and 11. He's scrambling now. <laughs> Defensive coordinators love this situation, don't they? Third and bullshit. long. They can do just about anything, and it's going to work, and they stop the offense that time. You go for it. You know that game's over. You know the game's over if you go for it. Don't be stupid. Nickel formation for the defense here. McCoy's going to receive the toss. That's a missed opportunity, and now they'll have to bring out the defense. This is where games are won and lost. Once an offense gets down the red zone, even though they're down more than seven, can you find a way to punch it in there for the touchdown and not settle for a field goal? First down here. Set up screen. Secures it with two hands. Advances it out to about the nine. Always a good job to pick up some yards when you're in the red zone. Nice throw by the quarterback, and he gets the completion. This should be the last play of the quarter. We'll run it. Here's the handoff. Picks up five. Good job, D. Good job. That's why you fly to the ball. Boy. 15 minutes down, 45 minutes to go. And you're watching the NFL on EA Sports. The Packers still driving as the second quarter gets underway. First down here after the run. And the second quarter is underway with this snap. 
Connor Barwin makes the tackle. They're just grinding away down here, inching closer to the end zone. Well, that's what you got to do sometimes. It's hard always to think that you're going to come out and just make big plays. You got to do the dirty work, and this offense is doing it right now. This will be second down. And he's in for the touchdown. Never be satisfied in the NFL. Players are just too good. So when you get a chance to score, even though you're leading, take advantage of it. Awesome job by the coordinator on those play calls. Packers now ready to kick the football down the field. Met head on right there at the 20. For this play, they'll go with two tight ends. The defense gets a sack. Well, if your offensive line is not good enough just to stop the pass rush, then you got to help them out. How do you do that? Well, you keep the tight end in, let him be an extra blocker, and you tell your running backs to help out too, blocking some of these defensive linemen. Throwing now to his left, Jeremy Macklin makes the grab, and he is brought down at the 45-yard line. Well, it was a nice throw by the quarterback that time to, to get just enough yards to pick up the first down. Let's see how they back up the big play here. Almost intercepted. There's a difference. When you play zone, you drop back and you watch the quarterback and you react to the football. When you're playing man-to-man, -man, all you're worried about is where that receiver goes. You try to shadow him, look for the football, and try to make a play. After the incomplete pass, it brings up second down. He's got a wide open alley. It's up six. When you talk about counter runs, what we just saw that time, the defense thinks the play's going one way, then a pulling guard or tackle comes around and catches a defensive lineman off guard and makes a good block. Bitch going to take it from the gun. And incomplete. You're near midfield. It's fourth down. What do you do? I got the answer right here. You punt it. Play field position. Make the other offense drive the length of the field to score. Plenty of defensive backs out on the field for this one. That's a failed conversion, but you might as well look at it like a turnover. It's going back the other way. Well, they don't get it on fourth down. That was, man, that was a quick drive once in the gym. That was just bad play calling, bad execution, and go to the sideline. That's where you deserve to be. Offense lines up here. First and ten. Quarterback drops back. Play action. Aaron Rodgers way down the field. In the promised land. Touchdown. What a terrible job by the defense. That time, nobody even covers the receiver. He is wide open down the field. And, hey, nice job by the quarterback going through his progression. He finds the open guy and gets a touchdown pass. The defender got caught in the neutral zone right there. That'll cost him five. Yeah, he's a little too anxious. You know, all these defenders, they got one thing in common. You know what that is? They hate quarterbacks. <laughs> they want to get there. A little too nervous there. Gets him caught in the neutral zone. 
They'll get set, looking to convert on this two-point try. Hand off. So from two yards out, they get it across and secure two extra points. The Eagles are prepared to return the kickoff. The Eagles lined up bunch formation. First and ten. He'll fire it out to the left. The Eagles get a first down. Hard to play man to man against such a quality wide receiver. He's fast, he's big. You gotta mix up the coverage. You play straight man to man, you're gonna give up a lot of completions. McCoy. Slashing to the right side. The tackle is made at the 40-yard line. When you're going against a really athletic defense, there's nothing like reverses and the counter-run game because they see it, they go, and you counter it, and that's why it works to perfection. Throws to the right. Should have had it. Well, he dropped the football, and there's no doubt why he dropped it. You have to look it in. Third down following the incompletion. Fix got it now on the sneak. He'll be brought down, but not before picking up the first down. Defenses are so aggressive in these situations now. A lot of coaches don't want to turn around and hand the ball off to somebody that's six or seven yards deep. Use your quarterback, run that quarterback sneak, and good job picking up the first down. First and 10. Running a little college-like option. That'll put them in what we call plus territory. What a nice run by the running back. Picks up big yards, and he did everything that time. He picked the proper hole, gets through it, and shows that speed to get the long game. Cooper's a receiver in the slot. First and 10. And he's thrown to the ground. Man, this defensive end, Jim, he is some talent. That time, good job. Makes the move, shows the speed, and gets around there and gets the sack. Second down. Jackson's going to pull in the bullet pass. The post route, deep down the field, going towards the goal post. It's not called enough in this league. Nice throw by the quarterback. That long game sets them up here on this play. McCoy is going to secure the handoff. He's brought down. Well, I know it's not going to make a highlight film, but still a good solid run up in there for a couple yards. We've hit the two-minute warning here in the first half. This will be the eighth play of this drive. Escaping the pressure, got a little crease, runs out of bounds. Find a way to score. That's always the mantra with every team when they get in the red zone. If you punch it in here, even though you're down by more than seven, it'll give you confidence for the rest of the game. Oh, it's on. Two tight ends, quick drop back. Touchdown, Philadelphia Eagles. What a tremendous throw by the quarterback that time for the touchdown. What confidence he has in that arm. Small window, very little room to throw that football in there. He didn't worry about it, fired it, got the touchdown. Well, this works out about 40% of the time if you look back on history, and they'll go for that two-point conversion. Put an additional two points on the board as they convert. They line up here for the onside kick. They want that football back. That kick came right at him, and it looks like the receiving team has recovered.
First down coming up. Screen. Got a completion this time. He's in the clear. Zone defense doesn't work in the NFL like it used to. Good job by the quarterback reading that zone and finding the open guy. They're back at the line after that catch for a first down. And he's in for the touchdown. That was just an awful job, wasn't it, by the defense? I mean, it's first and goal. Well, you know it's going to be a run, or I think you should be playing run. The defense not ready. They get overpowered, and they give up the running touchdown. Packers now ready to kick the football down the field. at the 18-yard line. They head to the line. The throw to the left. The Eagles now move the chains. Well, when you want to spy the quarterback, that's great. You might stop him from running, but look at the open people down the field. Good throw and catch by the quarterback. First down and 10. McCoy has got it on the handoff. Well, a short gain on the run that time by the offense. When you're a running football team, listen, there's going to be a lot of ugly plays that don't work. You just got to keep running them. Looking to the right side and throwing. Gain of 16. Perfect defense call that time. They allow the catch. The coach on the sidelines going, well, what else do you want me to do? We had the guy double covered, and you still couldn't make the play. Michael Vick will be under center. Now first and 10. And he's brought down by A.J. Hawk. Nice job that time by the defense. They were ready for the run. Nowhere for the running back to go. And they stopped him for a short game. Quarters formation here for the defense got to make that play. You don't see it often in today's game. These gloves these wide receivers wear, my gosh, anybody can catch it. I don't know how he drops. Jackson's lined up in the slot. It's third and nine. Gets away from the pressure. Looking for a receiver on the left side here. The tackle was made short of the first, and that'll bring up fourth down. Michael Vick will be under center. They'll turn it over on downs. Well, that's four plays and out for the offense, and that was bad. Bad play calling, bad play, bad execution. Go to the bench and try to rethink what you're doing. First down here. Play action. Going for the home run. Has the catch. It's just not done enough, I think, in the league anymore. Everybody's so careful. But look what can happen. You can have the perfect throw, the perfect catch, and a big play. Under two minutes to go in the half, and that means we've got a booth review. Well, it was called one way on the field, but now inside of two minutes, it was a booth review, and the call is overturned. I think if you left it up to the coaches, they'd like the, the booth to review them all, Jim, because put all the pressure on the officials in the NFL. That's what it's there for, to overturn bad calls on the field.
second down coming up. Setting up screen. And incompletion right there, but it really should have been an interception. Aaron Rodgers will be under center. It'll be a third and ten. Of course, it's a three and out. The Eagles decide to take a timeout here, leaving them with only one. Offense lines up here. Challenging the defenders to the right side. Change of possession coming up as they fail to pick up the first down on fourth down. Sean McCoy is in the backfield. First and ten. Running it like it's an option play. Nowhere else to go, and he's out of bounds. Always good to have these types of runs. Yeah, it's not a first down. But it sends a message. It shows everybody that you can run it when you want to. And also, it opens up so many other things for your offense. Double, double. Plenty of defensive backs out on the field for this one. Second and seven. The give up the middle. He'll be taken down about three yards short of the first. Good job by the defensive player squaring up that running back and just put his big butt right into the ground. McCoy's out in the slot. Third and three. Pitches it back. And he's out of bounds. Hunters all set here. There's a flag out. And that will close out the first half here. The city of brotherly love will be back after halftime to Philadelphia for the beginning of the second half. We're back here now in this one where the Packers lead by 24. There is a flag down. Brought down at the 41-yard line. Illegal touching. Offense. Well, the flag is out. That football did not travel 10 yards on the onside kick, and the officials saw it. First down on the way. Second half gets rolling now as he takes the snap. He's looking to go down the field here. And there's a 
sideline pass well, incomplete as rules. Jones lined up now as a slot receiver. Second down and ten. He's looking to the right here on this throw. That catch gives them a first down. You know, when you throw the football like that down the field, you pick up a first down. Now you can do anything you want on the offensive side, and you got that defense guessing. Aaron Rodgers will be under center. And now on first down, they'll go back to the air, trying to work that left side. And the interception by Patrick Chung. Nice job of the defense that time. In position, they read the quarterback's eyes, and it led to an interception. McCoy's in the slot, not in the backfield for this play. First and ten. Fix looking long, but it's incomplete. That's what you have to do as a defensive back. You got to wait to the last second. Wait till the receiver uses his hands, and once they go up. Put your hand in between them and knock that football down. What a play. Second down after the incompletion. He'll throw it over the middle. Ball's going to be incomplete. The hit knocked the ball out. Jim, that pass ends up incomplete because the defender, he just jarred the football loose with that hit. Nice job. Get that shoulder into the receiver, knock that football out, and get it to the ground. Third down now. And he makes the catch just past the first down marker. When you're behind in a football game, all you can do on the offensive side is just go out there and thinking about making plays and picking up first downs, good job by the offense. Casey's shifted out wide to the left as a receiver. First and 10. Here's the give to LaShawn McCoy. Someone's been injured out there. Hold on a minute. That's a good job. He's able to get up and get off the field. And my guess is he's going to be okay. A little bit of a scare there, no doubt about it. That makes everybody nervous. That second down coming up. They pick up the first down with that reception. Good job by the quarterback this time. He doesn't panic. He reads that it's his zone, and you have to wait for the receivers to get in between the defenders. Nice throw and catch. Back to the air here on first down. Working that left side. Makes the grab. They pounce on him there. This is turning into quite a drive, Phil. Uh, nice job, Jim, by the offensive coordinator. Just mixing the plays up and keeping the defense off balance. After the long game, let's see what they do here. First down, throwing again. Some trouble now. Looking for an open receiver on the right. The Eagles get a first down. The tackle was made. Well, even though they're down more than seven here, the offense down the red zone, it'll be good for them for the rest of this game. Their confidence uh, for the offensive coach that they could punch this in for the touchdown. That was a big gainer. Now it's time to back it up. He makes the catch. If I'm on the defense and the offense is this close to scoring, I'll tell you what I'm doing. I am sending everybody. I am going to gamble that it is a run. If they have the courage to throw it, let them. If they do, of course, it'll be a touchdown. They're going to get him this time. Quarterback was not alert that time. The corner comes on the blitz, gets to the quarterback, and takes him down. That is play number 10 on this drive. 
Running back in motion here. Third and goal from the eight. Throws to the right. Incomplete. Jim, when you get inside the other team's red zone, inside the 20-yard line, and you're down some points, you're thinking touchdown in these situations. Corners formation here for the defense. He sends the halfback in motion. Fourth down. Got to get it into the end zone. Ball is out, and it's a takeaway. They've got him down there. That's what you call a takeaway. The defense just makes such a hard hit that they take the football away from the offense, and they recover the fumble. Rodgers will be under center. First and ten as they go ground here, bringing the play to an end. Pretty typical play right here. When you're backed up against your own end zone, you run the football inside, and it just gets a short gain. try over again on second down. Looking to the right side and throwing. The Packers now move the chains. Touchdown! You never know with the talent of these guys nowadays. Little short passes. You think they're harmless and look what happens. They got so much talent all the way down the field for the score. Oh, he actually misses the point after. Also, defense. The defense, a little jumpy right there. The Packers with an extra point try on the way. Inside of the uprights. The Eagles are prepared to return the kickoff. He's in the clear. He's at the 50. Well, a lot of good things happen on both sides of the football this time. How about that return by the return team? Good job, good blocking. Look at the speed of that guy running. They get the tackle from behind. They stop the touchdown. Cooper's going to get set in the slot for this snap. First and ten. He'll fire it out to the left. Ball's picked off. That was an awesome job by the defense. They just read the quarterback's eyes. They got in position and they made the interception. Aaron Rodgers will be under center. First and 10. He's handed to the running back. And that's a two yard gain. Has a terrible read by the running back. It's a short game, but it's all his fault. He picked the wrong hole. He should have cut it back. He didn't, and that's why he was tackled. After the two-yard carry, it sets up second down and eight. Play action fake. Looking to throw. Looks to his left. And here's the pass incomplete. I don't know what was more terrible. That was a terrible route. Terrible throw by the quarterback. Oh, and what a shot. It's incomplete. Third down on the way. This doesn't look good. We've got a player down, and he's in pain. 
Well, that looks like an upper body injury, Jim. I think we both can tell that. And uh, now the question is, how bad is it? Uh, you just never know. First down, Michael Vick will take it from the gun. Trying to find an open man. Intercepted. They bring him to the turf. That interception is strictly on the quarterback. When you make bad decisions, I don't care how good you can throw the football. The results, usually it's going to turn into an interception. On first down, they give it to the running back. The outside linebacker that time just did his job very well and gets in there and makes the tackle for very little gain. Let's go now to Danielle Bellini, who has an injury update. Guys, I just spoke with a Packers official. Aaron Rodgers' injury doesn't appear to be anything too serious. Yes, he'll be sore tomorrow, guys, but that's not going to stop him from returning today. After being stuffed at the line of scrimmage, it's now second down and ten. He's got some daylight. And he's going to be tackled right around the 37. Why not take one of the best players on your football team, the wide receiver, and throw him some screen passes? It makes sense. Good job. Nice yards picked up. Here's the first snap after the big play. Going deep. Right down Broadway. That's a nice throw that time by the quarterback to the outside. He knows he gets his cover three. Where the weakness is, is at the sidelines. He took advantage of it with the good throw. This play set up by the long gainer. And that will close out the third quarter here in Philadelphia. We'll return in just a moment. The Packers are rolling. After a huge gainer at the end of quarter number three. Let's see what they do on first down following that huge play. Got a little screen set up here. The pass complete. He steps out. Nice situation here for the offense. They're winning the football game. Now they're in the red zone. Let's see if they can come up with a play that fools the defense. They've got a first down now after that catch. Looking to go up top again on first down. Challenging the defenders to the right side. The defense has got to be a little aggressive here. Your team is down. You've got to attack this offense. You don't want them to get in there and get another score. Aaron Rodgers back off the line. Shotgun formation. And they sack the quarterback. There's a couple ways to get to the quarterback, run over the tackle, or run around him. It doesn't matter as long as you get the sack. Rodgers will be under center. Third and 17. 
quarterback. Quick toss to the outside. He's brought down. That's going to bring up fourth down. Jim, when you get in these situations, there's not much you can do. Third and long, not easy to pick up first downs in these type of situations. Mason Crosby on the field now for the field goal try. He converts here on the field goal try. Well, this guy's a machine. Every time he gets a chance to go out there and kick a field goal, it is right down the middle. Good job by the offense, good job by the kicker. The kicking team now getting set here for what looks like an onside kick. The receiving team has the recovery. That'll stop the play right there. Offense lines up here. The running back goes in motion. Fix got it in the gun. Long ball to Deshaun Jackson. Wow, what a catch. Well, anytime you're in the red zone, you want to punch it in and get that touchdown. If they do that, look, they still, they're still going to be behind, but it gives them confidence moving forward. That play is going to be challenged. There is the red flag. Cooper's in the slot, second and ten. Setting up a little screen, brings it into his body. They bring him down at the 41-yard line. Well, that's a nice throw and catch by the quarterback and receiver. Puts him in good position where they have a chance to pick up this third down. Plenty of defensive backs out on the field for this one. Wasting no time. Here's the toss to the outside. And they sack the quarterback. And that's a quick series, a three and out. I don't know who to blame here. Was it a great play by the safety to get the sack on the quarterback? Or the quarterback just not paying attention, seeing him coming. And if you see him, you've got to change the play or get rid of the football a lot quicker. Quarters formation here for the defense. Halfback sent in motion. <laughs> Running away from the pressure. Eyeing that left side. So that's not going to get it done here. And the offense is going to turn it over on downs. When you decide to go for it on fourth down as a head coach, you've got to realize that you're going to be one of two things. You're going to be a genius or an idiot. And if you don't make it, Look out, the second guessing begins. They'll go with the extra tonnage here with the jumbo set. First and ten. Action fake. Aaron Rodgers way down the field. And almost picks off. Well, for some reason, this quarterback likes to keep trying to go deep down the field against this cover, too. That's not the spot you want to go. You want to look underneath or right down the middle. Now, second down. Here's the handoff, and they'll run it. And they get to him at the 45. What that run does, it just puts the offense in a good situation. So a good, positive run. Aaron Rodgers will be under center. Third and three. Coons going to take the handoff now. The defensive captain looks over and signals an immediate timeout.
quarterback is coming to the line, hoping to avoid being sacked for a third time. Touchdown. They're just running it up. Tight ends are becoming a bigger and bigger part of the passing offense in the NFL. It leads to a touchdown this time. Nice job just getting in position to make the catch. The point after try is in the books. Better pick another team besides the Eagles, brother. They ain't too good Packers with that. Packers now ready to kick the football down the field. Six-yard line. They face first down. The quarterback will hand it off. And he gains maybe three. You got to keep your offensive lineman aggressive, so you have to run the football every once in a while. That run, even though it was a short game, it served a purpose. LaShawn McCoy is in the backfield. He's looking to the right here on this throw. It's incomplete. The defender had it for a moment, but could not pick it off cleanly. This will probably be the last play before the two-minute warning here in the final quarter. Third down and seven. Throwing now to his left. The pass balls incomplete, and they fail to pick up a first down on this series. up in the pistol on this play. Vic in shotgun formation. This is going to set up a change of possession. We've hit the two-minute warning in the second half. Two tight ends on the field here. First and ten will go ground. And he's brought to the ground. This offense has been moving the football all day long. Once again in the red zone, they have a big lead. What will they do? I think they'll just try to run it in from here. Went with the ground game on first down, bringing up second. <laughs> Full house formation. Tight ends in motion here. Third down and three. They feed the running back. The tackle was made, but the first down is picked up. Well, how about that, Jim? Not a surprise. Down the red zone one more time. They're blowing them out, and this offense has been spectacular. What will they do here? You know what? I think they'll just run it and try to end this game. Finley is usually a tight end, but he's in the backfield this time. Nice tackle. Jim, the offensive coordinator, has done a terrific job so far here today. He's got his team winning. They're in the red zone. Let's see how clever he's going to be on this call. Two tight ends. The quarterback got the defense to commit, and it looks like it'll cost him five. Encroachment of defense. First down. Ha, ha, ha. 
<laughs> yeah, golf times again, fucking idiot. Offense lines up here. Takes an eight. <laughs> Takes the knee. It was a one-sided matchup early, and this game is finally over.